Hey guys, welcome to this video. Today we are going to be testing a battery powered hedge cutter. Now ordinarily I would only ever buy products from Still or Husqvarna or one of the well known brands. But on this occasion I've gone out of my way and I've purchased a bit of equipment from a garden centre. Now I don't normally do that. Now normally if you go to a garden centre like B&Q Homebase they sell their own branded petrol garden machinery equipment and it's normally okay for home use it's a bit crap for everyday industrial use so today i'm going to be testing and unboxing my new stanley battery powered hedge cutter now this is the uh, box it comes in and one thing that drew me to this straight away was the fact that it actually comes with a battery and a charger it's got the 4ah on it so that means you're getting the slightly more powerful battery, the longer lasting battery. As well as that, I bought this spare battery. Now this is only the 2AH. Now apparently with this one, you can use it for 35 to 40 minutes on a full charge before it needs recharging. And this one is 45 minutes to one hour. So, I mean, we're gonna give it a go. We're gonna unbox it, we're gonna have a look, see what the build quality is like, and then we're just gonna take it from there. Straight away, it feels like a very good quality bit of kit, actually. It's got a, well, it feels like a cheapy plastic handle, but it's a nice rubber grip on here, and that feels really, really good. You know, initially, obviously it's quite lightweight because we don't have a battery attached yet, but I can imagine even with the battery on, it's not gonna make that much of a difference. So now we get a good close up of the actual unit itself, and it's actually quite good, isn't it? It's, um, I say, very lightweight. Even with the battery attached, it's really, really lightweight. And I could think of so many advantages to having a lightweight hedge trimmer. As well as that, if you look down at the saw end, they've put this little pruning saw on the end, and I think that's really, really cool. That's a nice little touch. But uh, all in all, it's not a bad little bit of kit. And as I say, this is the charger that comes with it. Now, some of your customers may well have an outside power point, so you could always plug it in or put it into the garage and happy days. So if you're like me, you're probably gonna wonder how this thing works, how it operates. Now, just under here on the trigger. So just here, having a close up, there's a little button here. Flick that button forward, pull the handlebar in with your left hand. <sighs> and it works, it's fantastic, it's nice and quiet. I suppose it's now time to put it into action. It's actually not done too bad, but I think what I'm gonna do is test it on a bit of beach. So I've just taken a small bit of beach off here, which actually, it cut really well, to be fair. Now, if I go this way, you can still see some of the wispy bits that I haven't done, and then this bit that I have done, and it's actually not too bad. So having tested the Stanley hedge trimmer on these small little bits here, I would say for small gardens and little jobs, this is actually quite good. It's not bad. It's got really sharp blades, and it works an absolute treat. But if you're doing big jobs, big gardens. I think that's where the petrol equipment comes into its own. It's a little bit more powerful and you're gonna smash through it a little bit quicker. And I think that's what you want when you've got a big job. You don't wanna be doing something really, really slow. And cause it is slow, I'll be honest. It's not overly powerful and it is slow, but it cuts very, very well. And if you've got loads and loads of time on your side, then this is actually perfect. Now, as you saw, it has this saw feature on the end. So I want to test that now and see if that's any good. Right here, we have a little branch. I'm going to try and saw that and see how it goes through. Not very well. There's another little branch here, so we can try this one instead. So 
So the little saw feature is actually quite pointless because it doesn't work, it's not very good. That's a shame, that's disappointing actually. Now there is one cool thing that I like about this hedge trimmer and that is when you're finished with it and you put all your uh, safety stuff back on, I don't know if you noticed it at the start of the video, there's a little clip here and you pop it out like that. Look at that, it's a little hook. So if you've got somewhere in your van, you can hook it up. It's absolutely brilliant. Now my van's not super featured for this because I don't have any um, hooks or anything, but if I got some hooks put up on the side, I could hook all of my power tools on the side of the van. So it's absolutely perfect for storage. So my final verdict on the Stanley hedge trimmer is it's okay. It's good value for money. It's 152 pounds from home base. It comes with the charger and the battery as I've explained already. And the, the good thing is these are actually cheaper than steel. Obviously the, the, the unit itself is cheaper than a steel or a, a, any of its closest rivals. And the batteries are actually cheap as well. I think a, a battery with steel is about 150 pounds. Whereas the four AH battery, which is on this unit here is 40 quid. And if you get the two AH battery, it's 25 pounds. So it's a lot cheaper than the big brands but again you what you pay for a cheaper quality product is you don't get the power and you don't get the performance and that is something that we gardeners need for doing big jobs on a day-to-day -day basis so yeah for small jobs perfect little bit of kit but for everyday use I don't think it's going to cut the mustard so I think we're better sticking with our petrol stuff guys but um, listen you got a small garden you want something to do the job 152 quid you can't really go wrong for that yeah it's not bad it's all around so i give it as i say a six and a half out of ten this shrub here has also just been shaped with the uh battery hedge trimmer so it, it does a good job as you can see it looks all right doesn't it wrapping up this video here guys if you are new to the tattoo gardener channel why not smash that subscribe button hit the little notification bell and that will tell you when we've uploaded the channel and that way you'll never get to miss an upload we do lots of videos like this we do review videos we do garden maintenance videos whatever kind of garden related video we try and do it here on this channel so um listen if you are new welcome and i look forward to seeing you regulars on the next one so look after yourself have a great week enjoy the sunshine keep working hard take care peace out